Hey everybody, welcome back to my reaction channel. This is Core Harmonic, my name is Emre. Megan and I have already reacted to the Disney Plus Soul movie. We hope you enjoy this reaction. Megan's not here right now. I don't know when I'm gonna see her again. But shout outs to her, I hope she enjoys this reaction as well. If you enjoyed this reaction or you just want to be nice, then hit that like button, hit that subscribe button as well, and that notification bell, that one especially. Because apparently it's the new big thing on YouTube right now. It really helps more people to see my reactions. For the ones that are new here, welcome also. I react to trailers, TV shows, movies, and a lot of other videos created by YouTubers. This reaction is pre-recorded and many are as well as you will notice throughout these weeks and pretty much next year these are the reaction highlights and with that said enough jibber jabber let's get into this reaction right freaking and now i gave you a little bit of sound this time a little bit more okay. sound i should say Okay. Oh man. And I'm a little louder this time. Yes, hopefully you are a little louder. Okay. Because if you're whispering, nobody's gonna hear you. And now I'm not speaking loud enough. <clears throat> Alright, let's try something else. Joe. Uh from the top. What is his name? Right. Um one, Kenny two, B. Three. Kenny B. Oh, Kenny B is the one that's uh didn't you tell me that that he's the one that's doing that's doing the voice for this character in like Holland for like uh, the Netherlands for people in the Netherlands? But yeah, again, you're not speaking. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. You're not speaking loud enough. Yeah, they're bored and they're not really into it. Oh, she forgot to bring her text. Or she's lying. Or she doesn't need to be in the Yeah, or that, yeah. At least she's trying. Yeah, she's good at it. Yeah, she's pretty good. I cannot lie. Hang on, hang on. Because, um... Yeah, because she's taking it um way seriously yeah. than uh they feel like she should, you know, so they're gonna consider her a loser. Yeah. Yeah. And not cool. Yeah. But that's not true. She's awesome. Yeah, because the other one were like, ooh. Yes, and they didn't care and she cared enough to play. Yeah. He's really feeling the music in his soul. In it, and you know, the rest of us will. No wonder why this is called Soul. One yeah. of the reasons. Mm -hmm. Connie knows what I mean. Right, Connie? I'm 12. <laughs> <laughs> Connie's like, I'm 12. No. Yeah, at that age, a lot of. I don't care. You know. Job security, medical insurance, pension. Wow. That's, uh, great. Welcome to the MS-70 family, Joe. Permanently. <laughs> oh, so he just got a, a, a job. Working as security. With a pension, a mansion, basically everything. Huh. Die a happy man if I could perform with Dorothea Williams. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. this could be a lucky day. How convenient him talking about dying and he's just about to die, just like we saw in the trailer. So he just got to meet, uh, I think that's Dorothy Williams. It sounds so good. He's really good. Yeah. Yeah. And just that I can hear almost every day in this. Yeah. And I'm going to have a lot of work editing. Joe Gardner, where have you been? Yeah, but they're they're um, uh, but on the weekend you got a suit. Yeah, but they're kind of eating it. Back here tonight. First shows at nine. Sound checks at seven. You don't see how you. Oh, you don't want them to eat everything. Then go get it. Yes. Oh, he got it. 
for a second. I got the gig. Oh yeah. I, I don't know. I know. Dorothea Williams. Oh. You gotta get Man, he's just don't tell so my mom about this guy. He's not okay. even seeing anything else. It's like he's alone in the world. Oh no. The realization uh -huh. starts to uh, set in. Hello. They're shouting into the abyss. Darkness everywhere. And there's the light. Don't look into the light. Overdue. Uh, 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 I'm out of here. I don't think you're supposed to go that way. This can't happen. I'm not dying today. Not when my life just started. You remember when I told you that you ask stupid questions sometimes? <laughs> this is one of those today's. One of those moments again. Uh, before the beyond. This is the great beyond. I feel bad for yeah, me too. <laughs> he just got a gig to play somewhere, you know, and not have to teach anymore. That's cute. <laughs> Did you see that? He just pushed it. Your body's in a holding pattern. It's complicated. I'll get that you back to necessarily playing. He was like, ugh. <laughs> it was funny. Five, you'll be aloof, and you too. Why not? I could see that. Kind of. Oh, that's cool. Oh, wait a minute. What? Like this is where personalities come from? Of course. Ah. Oh. Okay, I see where you're coming from. Hello again, Terry. Don't play down with me. Yeah, <laughs> Jerry's like, don't play dumb with me. Jerry said that. Oh my god. Jerry has a good personality. I like that. Yeah. The way he's open on it and he's like. Yeah. Like, yeah, that, yeah. He has a sassy attitude going on. Think, of course. Okay, look. I'm sure your life was amazing and you did amazing things, but here's what we're gonna do we're gonna stand here in silence for a little bit, then we go back out. You say you tried, I go back to not living my non life, and you go to the great beyond. No, look. Talk all you want, Bjorn. It's not gonna work anyway. I've had thousands of mentors who failed and now hate you me. Mother Teresa. I have yeah. compassion for okay. every soul. Except no, you, you I don't still, like you. Copernicus. The world yeah. doesn't revolve around you, 24. You know, like Muhammad that, Ali. So. You are the greatest pain in the butt! Marie Antoinette. Nobody can help you. Nobody. <laughs> Wait, you're really not Bjorn Borgensen? <laughs> Oh. <gasps> Don't worry, they're fine. But you can't yeah, crush a soul it. here. That's what life on Earth is for. Huh. Oh, that, that's terrible. That's sad. Oh, that's what life on Earth is for. Oh. Oops. Check this out. I have been messing with this team for oh, decades. No. Lose another one. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, I cannot believe they did not just do that. He just <laughs> so the, the, Whoa. yeah, so this is that's yeah, me. That was nice. Thank this you. The guy she was talking about that can help them. What am I doing with my life? Oh I'm alive! I'm alive! Free yourselves! <laughs> You're destroying everything. <laughs> He's literally become a maniac. It's great. Look, there I am! 
His heart rate is increasing. I'll get the doctor. Mr. Mittens, you stay right there. What are we waiting no, 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 for? No, Joe, don't rush this. It's not the no, right. It's my time. Wait, not me. Uh... <laughs> He's like, well, that didn't go well. La 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 la. <laughs> I did it. I did it. I'm back. <laughs> he landed into the? the wrong body. Oh, he's a cat. No. And she no, landed no, in no, his no, body. No. I'm in the cat? 22. Oh, I don't know how to pause, okay? Look, I'm sorry. Uh, but come on, let's go. No way. I am staying right here until your stupid body dies. Which will happen any minute now because your stomach is earthquaking. You're gonna have to guide her through life, Joe. Who cares? And you. We only have room for one weirdo here. So scram. Get back to work. No one understands my art. Moon Wind, listen. I gotta get out of here yeah, and she's back not in nice. there. Well, we'll have to perform an old-fashioned astral transmigration to space. <laughs> oh, what? It's simply a way to get your souls back where they belong. It. And it's a glorious yeah. visual indeed full of charm. Oh, he's really good. Yeah, he's really good. So that's why they showed us the guy uh, spinning the sign. Says You're right to quit. I learned about quitting. Uh, you know what, Mr. G? I was practicing this one thing yesterday, and maybe you can listen to it and tell me to quit after, okay? Uh, okay. She's in conflict with herself. I like that. She's really wow. good. This kid you got talent. You really talent. love this. Yeah. So maybe I'd better stick with it. Yeah. Please, if I'm gonna get this gig back, I need your help. Okay. Really? I'll help you, but I want to try a few things. If Connie can find something she loves here, maybe I can too. Yes, Great. you can, honey. So, Don't move. I'm not moving. You're moving. Oh, be careful! Oh no! Oh no! 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 no. He's gonna go back! Oh no! no. Oh no! Oh no! Don't worry, I'm okay. Oh, no. She likes, so much for uh, being done chasing do after gigs, huh? That's his mom. And I hope that cat isn't supposed to be some kind of peace off. Megan, sit back, please. Just say you back. rescued it. Um, okay, no, no, it's mine. Fine. I rescued it. Hmm. Too bad you can't rescue your career. Oh. Whoa. <sighs> Just ask her nicely. His mom is rough. Business. She is not nice. You tell me you're going to accept the full-time position, then instead I hear you've taken another gig. Tell her that this one yeah. is different. This one's different. Does this gig have a pension? Off the rack somewhere, my mom has never understood what I'm trying to do with my life. Fine, we'll get like a suit off the rack somewhere. Like my that. mom has never understood what I'm trying to do with my life. 22! What did you just say? Mom, I know we've had some rough times, but you're right. I can't be truthful with you. It's like no matter what I say. I like that. The transition. You didn't see how tough being a musician was on your father. I don't want to see you struggle like that. Oh, so dad okay. could pursue his dreams I and see. I can't. Your father had me. Most times this shop is what paid the bills. So when I'm gone, who's gonna pay yours? I mean he could still have a job and still you know. And I know pursue dad felt career. the same way. I still pay uh, I'm just pay afraid the bills. that if I died today, that my life would have amounted to nothing. Joey. Let's make this work instead. That's my dad's suit. Lulu, Melba, bring your good scissors oh. in here. We got work to do. She knew that they were at the door listening. I love that this he gets to see really it nice. from... Perfect. A little bit like somebody else's point, uh, point of view, like from the cats. You can find your own thing to love when you get back to the U seminar. Now, come on, I need my body back now. No. Oh. I'm in the chair. Oh. Leave me alone. No. <laughs> now they're gonna fight. <gasps> Oh no. I was 
was gonna play with Dorothy and Woody. But I was about to find my spark. Find your you spark. Promised. My life was but you finally wouldn't gonna even change. Give me five I lost minutes. everything I mean, you because of you. Didn't have to take this body though. You cheated. You cheated life itself. <laughs> I love that they're ripping off each other. Welcome to the quartet, Teach. Congrats, Teach. Congrats. What would she love again? Pizza, what else? Um, Lollipops. Lollipops. But it's not often we find ourselves inspired. Oh, really? So we all decided to give you another chance. Oh, that's I like the I love that she said that. Ah, oh, they rigged the system. <laughs> They're funny. So, they what do you think you'll do? How are you going to spend your life? Figure it out. Baby. I'm gonna live. You're gonna figure it out. Of it. He definitely deserves a second chance. The way he went. Oh my God, I would have been so mad too. If he didn't got a second chance, it's alright, dog. Uh, yeah, I think it is. Okay, guys and girls, let's get into the review of this reaction. Kani's so good, you know she practiced before she came into the classroom. And this movie makes it crystal clear to why she has her doubts. Whether it comes to if she should quit or not in regards to playing her instrument. I love that what convinced 22 to actually having her own life is her passion for music. This movie encapsulates the very meaning of music coursing through the souls of these characters, which does start with Joe and Connie. Shout out to Megan, as you yourself have seen throughout this reaction, that she enjoyed this movie and did not want it to end as did I. Even doing her hair, which made me realize in the duration of editing this footage, that she had different styles from cutscene to cutscene. That one scene, my god, with Connie just looking at him and telling him like, Hey, I'm 12, of course I don't know what you mean. But she was still feeling the music and had at least a sense of what he meant. I love that he was fanboying over Dorothy Williams and was so excited to get these gigs. This indeed would propel him to stardom, which makes him super relatable, empathetic and didn't make his sudden death look ridiculous and feel like something that came out of nowhere. I love that as soon as he starts running and utters a send to the light, he asks one guy, why aren't you running? And the guy says, mm, I don't know. In such a hilarious way, what a gem that guy. The one kid pushing the other kid is one of the simplest and most adorable pieces of physical humor I have ever seen in cinema and real life. But my favorite line throughout this movie, apart from the stage performer forgetting her lines and asking for it and the tattoo artist messing up that one tattoo on the guy's back, which was serious yet hilarious in the context it was portrayed in. It's just a next joke for me, which should be such an old and outdated joke by now. So the next time I hear a next joke, you bet I'll be thinking about this one and just laughing my ass off. 100% the best part of this movie when it comes to humor. I wonder if the sassy rat-like accountant in this movie, whose attitude I love by the way, the obsession with him cheating death and doing his job to perfection is a nod to him being a perfectionist and maybe also suffering from OCD, which if I remember correctly is obsessive compulsive disorder. So is he the low-key OCD character within this movie? Is that also like a little easter egg they decided to place in there? Apart from the ridiculous amount of easter eggs they have probably already placed in this movie since this is, you know, Pixar. I love seeing the legends and the historical icons just interacting with 22 and the one guy just exploding with joy, feeling alive. And I never thought that I would have a favorite bum in cinema in general but now i do with this guy flipping the board in that one scene and him whistling while walking away in the other as soon as joe messes up and lands in the cat's body i love the lucky reveal of joe being 22's meant to be mentor and him being the one that teaches the teacher something 
and you just knew or at least hoped that the second chance was coming in this. I did like Joe finally standing up to his mom, telling her how he feels and her being blunt, which was understandable in regards to what she went through with his dad at the time. Even though she came off as a jerk crapping all over her son with what she said, she was still nice to her nosy friends slash employees when she called them out to help with Joe's dad's suit. So I do like especially that she showcased that she does have her son's best interests at heart. That scene and Joe helping 22 at the end come closer to actually having a real life were for me the two best parts of the entire movie and I would love to know what yours are. What was your favorite humorous part within this movie? Let me know that in the comment section as well. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Thanks for watching. Always check out my description, especially if you want to see the full night reaction watch along to this movie and many other TV shows and other content I post there on my Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash coreharmonic. Check out my affiliate links as well if I've already placed them there. I think by the time that you're watching this, hopefully I already have. If not, then those are coming later on. You'll see links to my socials as well, socials that I need to update and post a lot more on. But that's all in due time as soon as I have more equipment. And I guess there's nothing else left to say then. I hope to see you in the next reaction video, reaction highlights. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell as well. And in the future, I hope to see you in a full night reaction. Watch that. Bye.